here would be the horse. Only if he's like grown men with braces. On his teeth or his legs? His teeth. He was a thumb sucker as a child. It sounds quite wonderful, but I'm trying to make it work with Bob. Oh, no, honey. I'm guessing he'll be single for a while. Hello. Hey. Are you able to run your hands? What? Oh, yes, yes. He's also a year away from retirement, so you get a pension and a Winnebago. Again, thank you. But I'm sticking with Bob. That reminds me. Since we are no longer interested in Chukwemeka, what would you think if I set him up with somebody else? Why would you do that? He's so boring and arrogant. Yes, you are right. Well, maybe there's a woman out there who can see past those flaws. Someone with a lot of love to give. And enough frequent fly miles to take him to Aruba. <laughs> Are you interested in him? <laughs> no, I was thinking of somebody else. Tell me. Well, maybe. I haven't given him much thought. Either way, I wouldn't do anything without talking to you first. If it's somebody else, I don't care. And if it is me? <sighs> to be honest, I don't think I'll feel comfortable with that. Yes, of course. Good. And you have to be honest. Honesty is best. It is me. Everybody, nothing has happened yet. Did he ask you out? He did. But I told him I didn't want to upset you and I would talk to you first. It will not upset me. You said it would. I said it would make me uncomfortable. You said that, but your face was upset. Well, if you ask him my permission, I say no. You are my best friend. It will be too strange. Okay, well then that is the end of it. Yes, and that is the end of it. He's not actually here. Oh, you agreed to go out with him. So you lied to me. Ah, I was slow in telling you the truth. Now I am upset. How do you feel about Puerto Rican cops? 